Angry customers clamor to get their savings back from the collapsed Portuguese bank, Espirito Santo. This is a battle of Davids versus a Goliath, individual savers against the international banking system. Thousands were persuaded to put their savings in toxic investment plans, which then failed. One year after the BES was reinvented via a national bailout, they're still waiting for their lost money to be repaid. From January until March, they said the problem would be solved. He says they announced on the internet that we would be reimbursed with interest, but they've not even given us back what they owe. They're not honest people. I don't believe them anymore, she says. My husband believed until now, but I don't. Once one of Portugal's biggest lenders, BES collapsed after reporting a record loss in 2014. The country's fledgling recovery looked threatened and the government came to the rescue. The sound assets were transferred into Novo Banco as part of a 4.9 billion euro bailout. But there's still no news of reimbursement for these customers.